Let's talk about ear diseases in dogs. Uh, dogs' ears are very important. Obviously, they have a great sense of hearing. Uh, some dogs have very, very large ears like Cocker Spaniels and other breeds like that. And so lots of things can go on inside an ear without people knowing. The most common things that we see uh, are generally infections in dog ears. The ear itself is pretty complicated. Um, the ear flap itself goes into an ear canal, um, the, the external canal, which takes a very sharp angle toward the inner ear. And so lots of things can go on, again, that can't be seen with the naked eye. So your veterinary clinic um, will be able to diagnose what the problem is using something like an otoscope to look down into that ear to find out what's going on. Yeast infections, which, and also lots of bacterial infections, which can kind of look the same, so your clinic can diagnose between the two. Commonly also because the ears are, can be so large um, and around the head area, we see lots of trauma to ears uh, in dog fights specifically. Um, and also other types of traumas can form um, if there is an ear infection and the dog is shaking their head violently, they can break blood vessels in those ears and create a hematoma, which is a fluid filled sac basically in that ear flap that has to be medically treated by your veterinary clinic too. So always get a diagnosis if you think your dog has an ear issue. If they do, generally you're going to hear, uh, or I'm sorry, smell um, a, 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 a foul or sweet smell associated with that ear. They will also be shaking their head a lot of times and scratching at that ear constantly um, because it obviously is very sensitive and it bothers them.